Welcome back, everyone. Ready for another deep dive? Today, we're wading into the rumor mill surrounding who else? Beyonce and Jay-Z. Of course. Always good for a deep dive. Right. This time, we're looking at this podcast episode, um, Real Talk with Lady T, it's called. Okay. Yeah, I've heard of it. So they're saying Diddy's got all this like legal stuff and personal drama going on. Oh, wow. And then it might actually be impacting Beyonce and Jay-Z. Can you believe that? Hmm. Yeah. That's interesting, the way these things kind of, like, you know, intertwine, especially in the music industry. Totally. They were saying, even if Beyonce and Jay-Z aren't, like, directly involved with whatever Diddy's dealing with. Right, right. That any kind of, like, shakeup in their world could have ripple effects. For sure. For it's, sure. Yeah, it makes you think. It does. And, you know, this isn't exactly uncharted territory for B&J. We've seen this before, right? Oh, absolutely. I mean, hello, Lemonade. The mm -hmm. elevator incident with Salon. Exactly. They've definitely weathered some storms publicly. And Real Talk with Lady T did not hold back. They basically said this whole thing could be a huge turning point for them. It's like everyone's kind of holding their breath, you know? <laughs> like, is this going to be the thing? Totally. It's like this Diddy situation is making everyone rethink everything they thought they knew about Beyonce and Jay-Z. And you have to think about the timing of it all, too, right? Beyonce is at the top of her game. She's got the kids. She's got I... everything going on. Right, right. It makes you wonder, how much can any one person handle? Okay, so let's back up for a second. For people who maybe haven't caught this podcast episode, what exactly the Real Talk with Lady T say about Diddy? So they were kind of vague on the actual details. Okay. But they implied that it's, you know, pretty serious and that it involves his business dealings, which when you think about it, yeah. Jay-Z, Beyonce, they're all very much in that world too. So it's easy to see why people would be like, hmm, is there a connection here? Exactly. But it's important to note here, they didn't actually give any real evidence to say that Beyonce and Jay-Z are involved. So basically it's just speculation at this point. Yeah. I mean, let's be real. That's kind of their thing. Right. Got to keep people guessing. Exactly. But they kept saying this could be a real turning point for Beyonce, even implying that, like, she might make some big changes because of this. So wait, are they saying Beyonce is going to dump Jay-Z over this whole Diddy thing? Like, that's what they're hinting at. Well, not exactly. It's more nuanced than that, I think. Like, they're suggesting that um, yeah. that this whole situation might be, you know, the push she needs to really prioritize herself, mm. like her own happiness. Mm. Interesting. I see what you mean. Yeah. Regardless of what anyone else thinks. Right? Yeah, and that's where it becomes more than just gossip, right? Because that's something a lot of people can relate to. Absolutely. And it kind of plays into that whole thing about, like, our fascination with celebrity couples in general. Totally. We build them up, put them on a pedestal, and then... We want to see the cracks. Yeah, exactly. It's like we need that reminder that even these, like, seemingly perfect relationships, they have their own issues, too. And I think with Beyonce specifically, people have such a strong image of her. You know? Really independent woman, Queen Bay, the whole thing. So to even imagine, like, her marriage might be on the rocks. Right. It's like, okay. whoa, if it can happen to her, it can, exactly. it can happen to anyone, right? And Lady T and, um, was it Mr. T Riffic? Mr. T Riffic. They kept bringing up this idea of Beyonce reaching a breaking point, like with her career, motherhood, everything she's juggling. Which, let's be real is a lot for anyone. Oh, absolutely. And you can't forget about the whole, you know. The history. Yeah, the history there with Jay-Z and. Oh, right. Like with Lemonade, that whole era. Exactly. So it's like, is this going to be, you know, another Lemonade moment? Is this going to be the thing that pushes her over the edge? That's what they're saying. Yeah. Real talk even went as far as to say that if Beyonce and Jay-Z split up. Yeah. It would be like seismic. Like an earthquake. They said explosion, I think. In the industry. Because it would really challenge those expectations people have, right? About couples, about women, like even women like Beyonce having to make certain choices. For sure. It makes you think like if someone like her with all her power would actually choose herself in this situation. Then what does that say about like all of us, yeah. you know, the choices we make in our own lives? A hundred percent. It's so easy to get caught up in it, right? Like it's Beyonce and Jay-Z. Right. But at the end of the day, we're only seeing what they want us to see. That's true. It's all very calculated, isn't it? Totally. I mean, think about how Beyonce has handled these rumors before, like with Lemonade. Oh, yeah. She took something so personal and she turned it into art, you know, controlled the narrative. It makes you wonder if she is at a turning point, would she do something similar again? Who knows? But it's interesting to think about, right? Like even for someone with her level of control, 
there are still limits. You can't stop people from talking. So here we are with all the speculation, this podcast episode that's more about hints than hard facts. Right. <laughs> and everyone's trying to piece it all together. It's a lot. It can be a little exhausting, honestly. It really can. But I think that's why people love it, you know? It's a distraction. It's gossip. But it can also... It can lead to deeper conversations. Exactly. It's like we're doing now. Instead of just, like, are they or aren't they breaking up? Ah, right. We're talking about the pressures women face, the challenges of these high-profile relationships, and ultimately how much control we really have over our own lives, right? 100%. And that's what I love about these deep dives we always end up somewhere unexpected. It's about asking the interesting questions, even if there aren't easy answers. We may never know the full truth about Beyonce and Jay-Z. Probably not. But that's okay. It's more about the journey, right? Exactly. And this has been a fascinating journey. We've got a lot to think about. And who knows? Maybe this whole thing will inspire Beyonce's next album. Ooh, now that's a deep dive I would listen to. <laughs> right. Until next time, everyone.